Welcome, Croeso, to the Ballet Academy Online Tutorials. I'm Patricia Vallis. I run the pre-professional program and I've been working with Ballet Academy in various roles since 2004. Uh, so today we're going to do Pilates. I'm going to do a side sequence exercises to help engage your core, but also to gain proprioception so that you are aware where your body parts are. It's like a sense. Instead of being able to check visually, you can feel it. So we're going to lay on our sides. Make sure you've got space, comfortable clothing, no pets around if possible. And we're going to check if our hips and shoulders are stacked. So in, what I mean is the top one is over the bottom one. So you're going to use the top arm to feel that, feel where it is. And the body's in a straight line, head to toes. So if you did look down, you wouldn't be able to see your feet. If you bring them forward, that's wrong. If you just see your stomach, that's wrong. So a straight line and the hips and shoulders stacked. Uh, so we're going to breathe in for nothing. Breathe out and we're going to press the thighs together as we lift both legs just a couple inches off the floor and the head as well, engaging in your stomach. Lifting under the waist, so don't collapse under your waist. Press the thighs and relax. Breathe in. Breathe out. It feels like a live wire going through your body. And down. And breathe out. Press. We're going to do scissors now. So the bottom leg goes forward top leg back, they join together right underneath you and you switch. You keep switching the whole time, you're keeping the stack so you're not moving with the body. It's all about holding in the core as your legs move. That's where you get the workout, is the deep stabilizing muscles. So for more of a challenge, obviously you take off the top hand Move slowly, it's not quick, and then moving in the core slow, or a fifth, keep it stacked, you should be able to balance a champagne glass on your top hip, scissors, legs together, and down. The next exercise, the bicycle, we're going to take our bottom leg forward, it's to help stabilize, yeah, the stacking, and it's flexed. And the back, the top leg is behind you. We're going to breathe out as the leg extends like a développé front. <sighs> Press it behind, stretch, breathe in. Breathe out. <sighs> breathe in. The whole time maintaining this body. Watch when the leg goes back, not to go forwards. And again, breathe out. <sighs> Press, breathe in. Breathe out and in. Okay, we're going to do one last one. You take the top leg, bend it, sole of the foot on the floor, flex the lower leg, and we're going to try and gain muscle strength in the inner thigh. So we're going to be lifting the leg up, up, keeping the toe and heel on the same level. It's really important to stretch the knee bringing the heel out of your hip, otherwise you won't be activating that inside thigh. You can do about 24 of those. Yeah, you should feel a nice, nice burn, not a hard, horrible burn, but just a slight burn. Okay, thank you very much. Bye-bye.